Ayan, may talong sila. It's called Chinese eggplant. Ito talaga yung talong. Alam nyo kung bakit? Kasi hindi siya short. Long siya. showing you my latest visit in an Asian store and the things that I bought there and of course we are going to be eating in this video as well a little bit a little bit lang ha so okay let me ask you this nag-i-enjoy ba kayo magpupunta ng Asian stores kasi ako nag-i-enjoy talaga ako alam mo ba yung pagpasok mo pa lang na amoy mo na kaagad yung isda amoy ng isda alimango hipon iko e, ano-ano kaagad yung mga putahin na iisip mo like a taste of Asia talaga di ba and for us who miss home, yun kaagad yung naiisip natin, yung pagkain. Kaya nagpupunta tayo sa mga Asian stores or Asian markets. At gusto natin yung pinakamalaki, yung maraming choices, yung marami kang pagpipilian. Kaya ako, nagpunta ako yesterday sa Asian market. At hindi naman talaga ako nag-shopping to the max, but I grabbed the things that I usually buy there. Ayan, tapos yung mga nag enjoy talaga akong kainin. But before I am going to show you what I bought, papakita ko muna sa inyo yung how the store looks like. And of course, before that, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please don't forget to subscribe after this video. And thank you very much. Ayan. So ayan, samahan nyo na ako. Tara. So the place where they usually clean the fish, when you buy them here, it's closed right now because it's already past 6 o'clock. So they have lots of things in here. They have all the frozen fish and squid and seafood and everything that you can think of. There's octopus. It's cooked. It's $14.99 per pound. And then pala, mackerel, salmon probably to cod, uh, yellowtail. You could check some yellowtail right over here. Ayan, sea bass, all the prices right over there. So you gotta have to check the expiration on when they were packed and so on. When are they supposed to be sold? If they were freshly packed and then frozen and then until when they are supposed to be sold. And so there's some lobster tails right over there and then mussels right there. Ang tataba. Parang nakakatakot yung taba. <laughs> yellow yellow pa. Some crabs over here. Oh. And they're all pre-packed so they were all weighed already. So there's a dungeon crab. Dungeness, dungeon, dungeness crabs. Ayan, so many. Mmm, mmm. 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 Ito yung first na pinahanap ko pag may pupunta ako doon. Mga dumplings, mga ganyan, concessions ng mga to. Kasi may hindi talaga ako sa ganito. Especially pagkahapon. Mmm! Sarap! So this is a must try. Pag gusto gusto mo ng mga buns, mga dumplings, mga ganyan. Ayan, doon ka magpupunta. Although other big stores like Walmart and HEB carries that as well na. Yung sa mga frozen sections nila. Pero doon sa mga Asian stores, Asian markets, 
they always carry the best ones. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> At syempre, mawawala ba ang mga ramen, di ba? Wala! Ramen! Go! Go ramen! Go ramen! Go ramen! Go! <laughs> yung ramen talaga, hindi mawawala, guys. As in. So, ayan, dalawa yung binili ko. Ay, tatlo pala. Kinain ko na yung isa kagabi. So, ramen kimchi. Uh, Korean kimchi flavor. Ayan. So, di ba? So, ito, meron siyang soup. This one is for the soup type. And this one is for yakisoba. So, ito for this parang pansit kanton siya style. Wala siyang sabaw. So, ayan. Tapos, product siya ng Japan. Alam mo, parang natikman ko na to dati sa Japan. Alam mo, meron silang parang cake or hot cake sa Japan na yung super fluffy, right? Tapos, napaka-light niya talaga. As in, when you eat it, it feels like you're eating clouds. <laughs> parang nakakain ako ng clouds. Pwede kaya parang uh, cotton candy. So, this feels like it. When I go at the Asian store, hindi ko talaga to makakalimutan. Lagi talaga ako umiikot dun sa section ng mga tinapay at hinahanap ko to. Kasi, as in, I love it. Tapos, maliit lang siya, pero this is like a dollar and thirty cents. Which is not bad for a cheesecake. Sabi, fabulous cake that melts in your mouth. Ah, uh, <laughs> ang sarap niya, guys. Kakainin ko sana siya ngayon. Kaso, musog na ako. Pero tikman natin. Papakita ko sa inyo. Just to see. Hindi pa pala ako busog. <laughs> Kaso, kumain ako ng bite. At kakain pa ako ng noodles. Ayan. So, let's see kung tama ba talaga ang aking sinasabi. <laughs> tama. Mmm. Mmm. Ang sarap niya, guys. Sorry sa pillow. Ang sarap. <laughs> Kape. Kape. Sabi ko na, ititikim lang ko, pero masarap talaga siya. Mmm. Ayan. Dago ko na siya. So, this pork belly, I got this one as well from the Asian market. So, it's thick cut, which I love. Kasi may taba-taba siya. Oh, ayan. So, fish. This one is something that you don't forget when you go to the Asian market. So, either it's frozen, it's fresh, it's salted, it's dried. So, they have tons of fish. So, this one is salted uh, Alaskan mackerel. And I just put calamansi. Ayan. So, may mga buto-buto pa siya. I'll just leave it that way. And I'm gonna have to bake it for 30 to 35 minutes and then broil it a little bit. Ayan. So, exciting! So, ayan guys. Tapos na akong kumain at magpakabusog. And kasalanan talaga to ng aking vlog pag hindi ako pumayat. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoy this video. And if you do, hit like. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I hope when you go to the Asian market next time that you will be able to try those food. It doesn't hurt to try as long as you check the expiration. Meron packed by or uh, sell by. So make sure to check those dates. So thank you so much, guys. I'll see you in my next one.